Hey guys, welcome to Wrestling Days and welcome to an excited Wrestling Days. A genuinely excited Wrestling Days because this is huge. Uh, San Diego Comic Con, it is the biggest toy fair uh, collectibles showcase uh, in the world. And this is where Mattel show about the next six to eight months worth of figures. And uh, it's so special. It gets its own special exclusive figure. Uh, we've had the likes of the Shockmaster in the past. Uh, Isaac Yankum in the past. So uh, we were waiting to see what they would do this year. And we have got... Uh, answer about 10 minutes ago uh, at the time of recording this we found out just what the figure is going to be and it is huge I mean not huge in size but huge in name this is a figure that they've never made before um, and it is Mr. T uh, here are the images now, for those of you uh, that uh, maybe don't know the history of wrestling, Mr. T was in the main event of WrestleMania 1. He also competed at WrestleMania 2. He's also in the WWE Hall of Fame. So this is a very important person in the history of WWE to be in the main event of WrestleMania 1 uh, is huge. I mean, obviously, there's only so many people that have done that. Uh, the match was Rowdy Roddy Piper, uh, Mr. Wonderful Paul Orndorff uh, against Mr. T and Hulk Hogan. Uh, I really love the packaging on this as well because the packaging feels like the poster from WrestleMania 1. So this has got like very strong early WrestleMania vibes. Um, at WrestleMania 2, he went one-on-one -on -one against Rowdy Roddy Piper in a boxing match. Um, so he is very, very important. We've never had a Mr. T before. I've got to tell you, I'm sure I've heard rumours that there is a two-pack, a battle pack, that's on the way of Hogan and Mr. T in their WrestleMania 1 attire because this figure is not WrestleMania 1 or 2 attire. So if they have got the rights to make Mr. T figures, you would think they would do the WrestleMania 1 attire, but this isn't. So as exciting as this is, I think it's just the start. I think there could be more to come. I'm expecting a battle pack that has Mr. T and Hulk Hogan in. Uh, he's wore red at WrestleMania 1 and WrestleMania 2. Here he's in blue. He's got blue tights on. Um, and uh, he's, I mean, the figure's awesome. The figure is awesome. We just spoke about the packaging and how it's got that WrestleMania 1 feel. Um, this comes with a great entrance jacket, loads of gold, as you would imagine. Um, you know, absolutely dripping in gold. Uh, love the um, entrance jacket. Love uh, the fact it comes with like swappable hands as well. The face scan on this looks really good, really impressive. Um, and uh, for me in particular, it's just really exciting because I love the legends. I love the older figures. And we are going right the way back to like the beginning of Wrestle. Mania, but as we said, this is not based on WrestleMania 1 or WrestleMania 2, but it is certainly from that time. So, yeah, really exciting stuff. I am honestly, I can't wait. This is a figure that I am going to do whatever it takes to get my hands on. Um, so, let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Uh, Mr. T was the final missing piece if you wanted to recreate the main event of WrestleMania. We've had Hogan's, we've had Roddy Piper, we've had Mr. Wonderful. We never had, we never had a Mr. T until now. 
So, uh, yeah, this is huge. Uh, awesome, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. And hopefully see you again next time. Bye for now.